What's poppin' everybody? It's your favorite host out here, Barry Fisherman. Dun, 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 dun. That's right, I'm back on the show. Alright, I just like to say um, thank you to our fellow friend Chow Banana for inviting me onto the show so that I may present his findings. I just like to say that whatever my man has done seemed quite impossible from day one. <laughs> Right, so yes, I believe that attempting to read 30 books in th that's a different video. We're talking about something crazier, all right, something that pushes your body to the limits you never thought was even possible. Somehow, proving your body has its own will and sheer power to adapt to its surroundings. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, our boy Chabana has attempted to masturbate ah, for right, 30 ta -ta. All right. Thank you for the introduction, let's roll the clip Do we see people running when the sun hasn't come up or right before it goes down? The serene scenery combined with the cool breezy air surely hits the spot when you embark on your 3 or 42 km run depending on what level of dumbass you are I mean seriously, who the f would run 42 km? Like what the f your mother feed them when they were younger running shoes damn it seems like everyone is running at these cool breezy times you know so i was like damn why don't people run during the hotter parts of the day <laughs> hey d why are you hot sun 12 o'clock like that don't run oh too hot <sighs> oh so that's why we don't run in the hot sun <laughs> well of course at a time like this right seems like a challenge has emerged and at a time like this a challenger will emerge and what do we love more than to complete a challenge obviously running away from it that's right deep down inside we're all f pussies but you know what cha banana had different plans he turned around and he said no no more pussy me all right i'm gonna go and beat this guy up and then it's time for me to be a new man dun -dun 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 -dun. that's right he done 30 days running in the hot bloody sun all right so before we get started you know let's get the tv going Damn. Much better. Alright, so as I was saying, taking up this challenge meant going against everything Chow Banana stands for. Right? He's someone that will wake up early, will get his workouts done early, and then he will go to sleep early so that he can wake up early to get his workouts done. The most part of him waking up early is so that he can skip the hot sun. But then since he wants as hot as Malaysia has to offer, why would he wake up early anymore? Over the next 30 days, or as like students sitting in a classroom be like clock is like 30 minutes left until class that means 5 minutes, 6 times, 3 minutes, 10 times yeah we go like that so which means 4 weeks 7 days for each week he increased uh, gradually so it was 3, 5, 7 and 10 km why run up to 7 to 10 km? <sighs> just cause he can I guess because he got time uh. now no need to study also <laughs> so yeah the first week passed by quickly with the 3km run, you know. Um, as you can see, uh, I run quite steadily, you know. Man has that posture still. First first week, it's okay. You know, the only cool thing that was witnessed was probably like the cloud movement. If let's say you descend on a cloud shade for 5 seconds, right? The chances are by the end of 5 seconds, you wouldn't be under the cloud shade anymore. <laughs> Since men didn't have like sunblock, uh, sunscreen, uh, sun lotion, uh, sunflower, uh, we had to go with the traditional way, which is pray and sacrifice some sweat and just drape a shirt over the head. You know? Uh, yeah. Let's pause right there. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Handsome. Handsome. <laughs> 
Right, so the second week starts with a 5km run. Alright, and like, you know, the body had started to adapt to these temperatures by this time, you know. Um, it is found that like, breathing really helps. Like, when you focus on the breathing, especially if you guys watch Demon Slayer, it's pretty much it. Before moving on, uh, let's have a quick chat with Day 10. Thank you, Howard. It's day 10. I feel lighter already, you know, with all that hot sun. I'm getting used to it day by day. You know, four more days of 5k, you know, I feel good. Alright, back to you, Howard. So, yeah, thank you so much for that. Um, uh, on top of that, let's talk about how I found two different routes to... Day 21 wants to say something. What? No, but just do it. We need two, two days in a row. Uh, yeah, uh, day 11 has something for us. Thank you, Howard. I accidentally stubbed my toe last night. <sighs> and I've been running with a half pronoun the whole time. One step at hey, a time. You know what I'm saying? Eh. What's so serious? Stop toe only, ma. The toe gonna come out only, ma. Wallah. Need to be so dramatic and all, man. Eish. Anyway, as I was saying, right. So I have two roots, alright, that alternate between. There's one. And there is two. The reason that I have two different routes is so to keep things um, a bit different like you know. If I were to run the same every other day, right, I probably lose a lot of motivation very quickly. Alright, as you can see, uh, the clothes have come off the face. I found sunblock, uh, sorry, I mean, uh, my mom found sunblock <laughs> because she was like, uh, Boy, uh, you running in the sun? Yeah. Then, are you stupid? Yeah. Let's talk to day 14. Hi, thanks so much for having me. You know, it's a privilege to be on the show. But uh, I have to say, uh, after 14 days, the only feeling I have now is pretty much a uh, regret. <laughs> but you know, we keep moving. Hmm, I wonder how day 30 me, Howard is doing. Hmm, let's ask him. Yeah? Wait, 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 no, no, that's... Hey, what's up? Yo! Oh my god. Dude, we're done. We did it, alright? It was our willpower that brought us here. That brought us to, to this day, day 28, week 4, done deal, hot sun, hot sunning or shit, bro. And like, you know, actually I really want to know like what were you think uh, what are you thinking right now at this point of time? You know, with four more 14 days to go. I mean I'm pretty much hoping that uh, I stay alive. Not looking forward to the 7 and 10 km and like you know, first time wearing sunblock, so uh, pretty sure I think your skin should be good by now. Yeah, if it's not, then uh, that concludes the fact that it uh, doesn't really work lah. <laughs> and also, uh, does your toe still hurt like a bitch? Because uh, mine really hurt. Oh yeah, yeah, like you can see my face here. Yeah, mm, almost same as yours lah, which means actually works lah, you know? And like my toe, the toenail came off. Wish you all the best for the next 14 days. Just know that you you get it done. Treasure the 3 and 5 km because 7 km. It's gonna be one half, alright. You know? Alright, I'll see you. I'll see you soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so like I guess that's how you roll out here. And yes, I will definitely remember my 3 and 5 km times because uh tomorrow will be a different day, yeah? So yeah, thank you so much. Uh back to you, how huh. I didn't know we can do that. Well that was insightful to say the least. <laughs> well, let's get back on track with Hey, psst. Change your plans already. Because now EMCO. What? So, uh, you're not running anymore. Never mind, one. Voila, we eight K cases every day. We already at the peak, ma. Come on, lah. We Malaysians, ma. We need to be. We are very patriotic. We are strong. Hey, uh, right, oh we my can God. get it. Just shut up. Okay, I'll pay you double. Just shut, shut up. up. Relay the message. Okay, okay. Okay, so change of events due to wait, EMCO. Wait, wait. wait, guys. I'm here, alright. I have decided to run the course of the neighborhood itself. This is going to be a much harder challenge for me. Well, it's really like I, I need to run just the same route again and again. Hopefully, my mental game is strong enough to continue running for the next two weeks. You know, I don't even want to think about the 10km now because I'm already dead. So, yeah, 7km. Let's do the 7km first. Lah. Okay, back to you. Oh, guys. well. Um, what a turn of events. Uh, your boy is about to get paid double and the run continues. Yes. <laughs> anyway, so man had also crafted out two routes for the EMCO period within the neighborhood. And 
uh, one uh, one as you can see here uh, is going through every corner of the neighborhood and the other one there it uh, goes through the same uh, back and forth thing so um, as you can see with the thickness of the lines uh, you can see how much I run the same round like I was about to kill myself like like damn damn look at that look at that look at me look at me yep yeah yep you know ah yeah this is the point where I was like damn why do you even start this challenge <laughs> despite all that all of that all right your boy still made it to week number four and ooh wee yeah you know do I sound like the ring and Morty like ooh wee all right so yeah it's about time the time where we push ourselves in it all right so let's see how day 22 day thought about it after a long night and uh, i think uh, i'm good to do 7km for the next week also wait you didn't run wait hey. hey, again why you guys day 23 and uh, i'm good you know you do you you know i'm good i'm done 7km is enough hey how read 25? Okay lah, 7 8 km, enough lah. Hey, why, why are we doing this show? 26? 7 km, enough. 7 km is enough. 26 ah, 26. Wow. Wait! Huh? Never see you go shit before, man. Hey, come on lah. Come on, you never shit before, is it? Wow. Easy. 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 Disgusting lah, yeesh. Hey, hey, why? hey. Day 28 got something to say. She even prepared a clip for us. Alright, so um, I guess uh, let's play, let's have day 28 for us. Day 28 has a special for us. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. And today, let me tell you something, today is the last thing. Today, I will end this bullshit challenge of me running in the hot damn sun because I'm dying man, like legit. Another, if I do this for another week, I'll probably have to kill myself. And on top of that, today, look at this guy. It's bright, it's heavy, it's hot. Today, God has told me Alright, today, you will suffer. Today, I will show you the true meaning of Like that, man. So, yeah. see you guys when I'm done. Oh, finish ready. Finish ready. Yes. Oh my god. Are you done? Look, look at the team on the end game. It's the end game, bro. Let's go. Yeah. Wait. We finished already. Day 28, right? Wait. Oh my god. The challenge finished. Damn. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so four weeks under the hot sun, what's the catch? I had the verdict of Chabana right hey, hey, here. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, you damn noob lah. Come lah, we do together. Wow. You think you damn good, is it? Come lah. See Ons who do la. better. Okay, let the comments decide who better. So, first things first, it's a really good way to get a 10, you know? If you see the card right here, alright, you can watch my music video where I ask when's the 10. Alright, so yeah, you want to check that out. But on the way of getting the 10, you might, you know, get skin cancer. So you might, you might want to watch out. Next thing, right, is the amount of resiliency built never be talked. You know, it took a lot of effort to keep moving before and during the run. You know, it's evident that my body cannot even like take the 7km, let alone like 10km. If I were to run 10km, right? Die already. <laughs> yeah, man. Like, my body was screaming in pain while I ran the damn 7km, you know. Like, I cannot even imagine attempting 10km. But other than that, to be able to run 7km in the hot sun, right? Whew! Has done me a lot of good, especially to my mental strength. Lastly, like, we would like to add that the starting is the hardest part of the journey. You know, the moment you step out of the house, half the battle's already won. Yeah, man, same. Like, cause like, you know, to even make myself put my socks on, right, was like a struggling matter to say the least, you know? But then, you know, no regrets trying out this challenge. True. So yeah, remember to let us know in the comments down below what other crazy challenges 
no sane person will ever do. And you know, maybe we'll give it a shot. Right. So that concludes this video. You know, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. And we'll, we'll see, see you guys, guys next time. time.